come and show me. Let me see your vision here. All right, let's get on the same page. Mm. Mm hmm Okay. Like, you said you want to be able to put stuff underneath here. Thought about that. It doesn't have to. It's just, that's pretty low for cooking, where you've got. Yeah. Here, you hold this. Okay. Got it. Realistically, that's probably about right. But this is too low. Um, no, it's because that cooker sits up this high and everything else, I mean, it, it wouldn't be too low. And then how wide are we? Are we using the full eight foot? I mean, you, do I want stuff out here? Probably. You might as well use it. Yeah. Um, I wonder if I have, okay. So for this one, maybe we could use a, like a, a two by eight. And then it gets you up higher, but fills this void. Well, we have a two by, go grab that treated one out there. Okay. I don't know if it's long enough. It's, you should have that orange tape measure in your little pouch there. I should. I don't want to add that much weight. Feel how much heavier that is than a 2x4. Why would you want to attach that to this? Okay. Right. No, I, I think that's absolutely silly. silly Does it have to be a 2x8? I don't know. How does that feel? First? It's fine. I mean, because then the uh, cast iron cooker is about here, uh -huh. and then the grill is about here. Yeah. So I think that's fine. But if you don't want to use a 2x8... Well, I mean, that's a shit ton of weight compared to a 2 Because we could just use a freaking 1x8 also here. Be just pretty side. And then 2x4 the rest of it. So if you're worried about closing it in, I have extra siding over there. Why don't I just screw siding? to the back side of the 2x4, so all you see is a siding. Okay. And, and it's much lighter. Okay. Is that okay? Mm -hmm. Yep. Forget the 2x8. Okay. We'll work on that one. Okay. We're gonna make it seven feet wide. I haven't figured out how deep yet. Working on that scenario. Jason, do you need to find your patients? Look deep to the sky, find it. Yeah. You looking up there for it? Ah! <laughs> You to miss. You buried the hatchet, but left the handle sticking out. It's a good friend of mine, Garth Brooks, saying that. Okay, let's build. Or I'm about to paint this. Paint this town red Jason. and paint your wife white. <laughs> Kid Rock saying that. Okay. <laughs> so enough musical references for one day. I wonder what Kids Rock Kids Rock's doing right now. He's probably on a boat. In, Mich what? in Michigan. Oh, somewhere around Detroit? <laughs> yeah. Well, he's a big Detroit advocate. Yeah. Advocate? Let's build. Can if we it don't crank, it ain't from Detroit. I don't even know who sings that one. Mm -hmm. if, if you know, just put your little comment below. If it don't crank, it ain't from Detroit. I'm about to paint this board if you don't get to building. Because the paint could have dried by now. Let's go. Okay, I'm building it. Myself. Oh, you know, that's that song that says the best boat is a sold one. <laughs> that's a smart. All right. That is smart. Where's that handy level you had in your bag? Oh, I do. I brought a level. What you got in For the bag? first time ever in all of our Shabin projects, we have a level. Crazy. I always considered myself to be pretty level headed. Hold it. 
Talk about some more song references or something. Patience is a virtue, they say. Who is they? Ready for me to do it right here? No, not there. Look at that fire in the window in there. Hope we don't have to take that out. I was just kind of going to mock this up here. Well, I guess we'll hammer it in. That's where you want it? Well, I... shit. It looks good. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to hurt you. What? About to quit. I quit. I'm not doing this job no more. You can take this job and shove it. Oh, you didn't check level? It was level until you went screaming after it. Do you want me to take the screw out? How does it look? Tipping. Yep, gotta raise this one up. Okay. What? You're, what are you doing? Long way, Vern. I'm going to tell you, Laura built something, you're never taking it apart. You know why? Because the head of the screw is this far into the lumber. Gone. Wait, no. What are you doing that for? Just put another one here if you want to put one somewhere. Okay. Oh, yeah. Just random haphazard wherever you'd like. That's how you do it. No, ma'am. I'd put one here and one here. She's good. Okay. Okay, and then how wide is it going, sweetheart? Well, that's a good question. Mm. Let's go over here and have a conversation. Mm. Right. 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 Let's have a conversation about how wide this thing's going to be. How wide? How wide? Okay, so it could either be these four. At least. Or add, I have enough. I think this is good. You do? So, what is it when it's all together? Yeah, that's the question. Okay. I think you say it's about 27 inches. I think we'll need a little overhang. 26. Okay, yeah, give us something to talk about. No! No. You're done. Is that Alanis? Your life is not a musical. Who sings that? Your life is not a musical. But do we have time for a movie montage? No. What's our number then? 26? It's a good number. Yeah. Okay. Atlanta. <laughs> That's from that. Uh... Oh. It's getting a lot done here today, folks. You remember that movie with. Uh... It had uh, Jennifer. No, Christina Applegate and. Uh... And uh, that other blonde gal, that wedding, whatever. <laughs> Let's get out, we can leave this city. Let's drive to the open air. Yeah, the countryside is so pretty with the wind blowing in your Sauce. What? Awesome sauce. Nothing. Awesome sauce. Got to go on the outside here. Yes. 
good lumber. It's really good lumber. I mean, you saved big money, but... We did save big money. What does it cost you in the long run? <laughs> I did it! <laughs> no. I did it, Laura. Good job. The second time. Okay, the outdoor kitchen's coming along nicely. If I go right to the corner, you know, I could notch that and it could help hold that up and it could probably get right to this corner. Would it be easier to have these on the outside of this? So I have to notch my countertop out? For you, for sure. Does that make your life easier? Yeah, I like it. Okay. Want to level? <clears throat> we have a level. I want to level this. Okay. But I also want to make sure this. First, let me level this and I'll hold this. Okay. Yeah. Anybody talk about how much this netting is awesome? It's awesome unless you're trying to work in and around it. It is awesome. Now this one's gonna be. <laughs> one more interesting there. It's this whole corner. It should have just should have extended that roof line out further. I don't know. Like this. What, what are we gonna? What do you want to do here, Magic Mike? <laughs> Go. Up to here, piece that in. I don't know. Ah, oh, this whole corner is a thing. Um, and it can't go on. This did not work. We were trying this on the other side. The only thing we could do is just on this side, uh -huh. we could just go from here down and just not have it go to the roof. Then what's the point? I like it. I mean, I like the look of, of it. It'll help stabilize the roof for winter. Right. I'll, I think you're right. You just put it where that one is over there. Okay. And then... Let's take this netting down. Why is that not down? Because uh, I figured we needed it for our outdoor kitchen, don't we? We're going to rewrap it anyways. Right. I'm going to take it down because it's bothering me been bothering me all day what kind of screws you think are in there square, square. throw me those other two uh treated ones will you please i will please you want three stacked here yep let me go oh, fingers were over there are we going to extend this two by four as well oh mm. it's got to be here oh my dear Okay, so let's rethink this. I could notch one of them out and just put it like in here, like right here. I mean, that would be the easiest and best. Yeah. Even if it were, could it work on the outside? Pretty close, no. I thought it didn't work on the outside. Inside. It has to be on the inside. I thought you were taking that netting down. I got distracted. See, that's right about there. Oh. So the out, it would actually, I think, be outside and inside. But you gotta get mm -hmm. that netting down first. Definitely. Good, I can't wait. The netting was great. Probably still gonna utilize it. Yeah, don't this destroy it. This kitchen needs to be wrapped. We still have some from the other parts of the porch, right? Um, this was, yeah. Okay, I need a ladder. Yeah. Ow. Naughty stick. Something poked me, ow. ow. It still hurts. It's that, it's, ugh. 
I don't know if it was like part of a screw, like a piece of metal. Mm -hmm. Was it this guy? <gasps> Shit, it was that guy. I mean, so. I, yeah, definitely. The way it feels, yes. Oh. I got stung by a bee. There he is. Oh, he got me good. It hurts still. I'm going to have to like go rub mud on it or something. Dang. Don't do that to my wife. Oh my gosh. Okay. I have to I wonder where the hell he was sitting. He must have been like right behind right there. Up in yes. the netting. Yes. Cause I I felt like a like a metal shaving. It still hurts real bad. I bet. Okay, I gotta go deal with that for a second. Deal with it. Ready? Yep. I like it, I like it, I like it. Level comes in handy. Yes. And just so you don't want to just put that other two by four where the other two by four is so they match. I do. Okay, I thought so. That bothers me, does it bother yeah, you? Yeah, it bothers me. And we'll just put it, like, yeah, wherever that one is you know, left to right, and, yep, sure do. What does that have to do with it standing like this? Just correct. Are you still talking about this? I'm talking about this. It's mm -hmm. fine. It's fine. Beautiful mess. I like that it matches. Oh yes. The nice thing about it is we've added stability St for stability, stability. It's cute. I think it'll be great. We can grill and cook out the window here. Looks like now we can probably have to put some supports in, and then we'll start. Laying our top on, huh? Yeah. Okay. Hmm. Okay. All right. Twenty-two and seven eighths. And how many do we want? One, two, three. I was gonna lay them the long way. No. Why? The support's going from here to here. Oh. I thought you meant my top. What's been on my mind? Sick and tired of the nine to five in the city light. Hey, darling, we could get out of town. See the beautiful world around, wanna see it now. Pack our bags and get in that car. Real far. Let's get out, we can leave. So this stuff that I'm using, this reclaimed lumber, um, you may recognize this side. We used it inside the shabin. And it used to be somebody's floor that they ripped up out of their house, which is crazy because it's pretty. Um, but anyways, this is the last of it. I think I paid, if I remember right, it was like 60 or $80 for all of that. And we've used it for a lot of projects. A croquet. croquet with a croquet, croquet. Oh, that piece there won't work without the support. And I'm gonna need a little piece of board. Oh, yeah. You know. Laura, this is B E A U T. It is pretty, isn't it? I wish I had a sander, but. Sander. Thought about painting the top of this. I will not be painting the top of this. I will be cleaning it and just prettying it up. Mmm, mmm, mmm. I like the way you bang. 
Girl, what you got in that bag? Yeah. What you got in that bag? I need a support. Girl, yeah. what you got in that bag? What are you talking about? You're driving me crazy. I don't know. The heat? The heat has gotten to oh, you. Oh, that's nice. They can't see my face. Something. What? I think they can't no. see. Mm. How about right now? No, oh. oh, no, there you are. Where were you? You come back. <laughs> You've done lost your mind. I was just your marbles asking Laura are gone. What she done got in that bag? I need a two by four. This city, let's drive to the open air. Yeah, the countryside is so pretty with the wind blowing in. Oh,